Hey guys, welcome back to Hype Hunters. My name is John. I'm Caleb. And today we are going to be discussing uh, some of the cards that are coming out here in the month of April. So we're going to go ahead and talk about like cards that are just releasing at the end of March 1st that are going to you know start showing up in April as well. Uh, be on the lookout for the usual stuff that's been releasing at the end of um, this current month of March. There's been Donruss basketball recently. There's been um, a lot of Shining Fates and a lot of battle styles. So be on the lookout for all that stuff, um, as well as this new stuff that's gonna be coming out. So the first big product release is gonna be Prism Basketball, guys. So this is a huge one. We're really looking forward to this. Really hoping to find some retail. Um, if you guys did not see our last video yet, be sure to check it out. Hopefully you guys can maybe even snag some retail online just sitting at your house. So Prism Basketball is a big one. Um, biggest set of the year. Releases in hobby and retail. So it should be hitting retail stores likely in, I would say two weeks from now, will probably be the first run of it. Um, it's listed for 331, but I heard rumblings it might be delayed by potentially a couple of days or a week. So that's gonna be the first one to really be looking forward to uh, in the month of April, and it will kind of be released throughout April. So that's gonna be number one. <clears throat> yeah, and then getting into some of the more bigger hobby sets coming out in the month of April, uh, we have on um, April 9th, we have the 2020 Panini National Treasures football, which is one of those biggest sets that always has like the super uh, limited cards. Uh, Very expensive, yeah. super insane. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I can get some great pulls on that. And then on April 14th, we have the Panini Contenders Optic football, another hobby set. And then we also have uh, Origins basketball yep. coming out so, as well so. yep so the football products for the hobby are going to be the justin herbert and joe burrow class mm -hmm. still so pretty cool there still get your last chance at some of those cards uh they're rookies at least yeah um and then uh getting into a couple more releases in the month uh john's going to talk about a couple more things in retail yeah so uh <laughs> for april 16th we have 2021 bowman baseball that should be a retail and hobby uh, opportunity for you guys and then we also have contenders basketball coming out on uh, April 21st as well so those yep. are two big opportunities for you guys to get some products at retail stores or online uh, definitely great pickups there so then uh, after that there's a couple of soccer products that are coming out um, near the end of the month uh, mid to the end of the month um, tops chrome Bundesliga soccer the tops MLS um, soccer and then the Museum Collection, Champions League Soccer, and uh, uh, what is that one? The Premier League Impeccable Soccer. Mm -hmm. So a few different soccer releases. I'm pretty sure most of those are hobby, but in case any of them are retail, do be on the lookout for all of those, obviously, as well. And then uh, getting into the last couple of products, uh, releasing in April for sports. It's going to be the Panini Chronicles Football. That's still going to be the uh, Joe Burrows draft class mm -hmm. and Justin Herbert, I believe. And then uh, right at the end of the month, it should be uh, time for Panini Prism draft picks football. And that should be the Trevor Lawrence draft class and all of the new rookies that are going to be drafted uh, right near the time that that product is released, uh, near the end of April. So that's pretty much all the sports card releases for the month, but a pretty big release uh, for sports overall still. So Yeah. And then just kind of getting a quick little look at the products released for Pokemon in the month of April. Uh, as we've seen with the month of, month of March and February, there was a ton of Pokemon products being released. April, not so much. We just have the new Alola first pack, uh, first partner pack, which is going to be those jumbo cards being released, and then the Pokemon Japanese uh, S six H. I'm not entirely sure of what that product is, but uh, you definitely should be expecting a lot more Shining Fates, a lot more Battle Styles being released in the month of April. Uh, probably nothing else new that's going to be released, but uh, those products are still very desirable. Shining Fates and Battle Styles, oh, maybe not Battle Styles, but Shining Fates, definitely still desirable, so definitely be on the lookout for those uh, if they are released at retail or uh, online. So. Yep, so those are going to be the big releases for this month. Also, maybe you'll even find some uh, spare hidden fates around um, yeah. in the month of April still. So pretty exciting stuff here this month, guys. Uh, very excited for Prison Basketball. We'll be hoping to rip some of that on the channel if we're able to find some. So uh, really looking forward to that. And we'll see you guys with a new video soon. Uh, be sure to like, subscribe if you guys do enjoy the content. And we'll get back to you next time. Thanks. See ya.